Before we get into your hilarious special teams play, yeah. um, explain the play that got you down into the score zone. Right? You, you, had a, you had a big hand in that. Um, well, actually, this was just to start off the drive. Um, I guess they wanted to take a shot down the field. It was actually a choice route. With the choice route, um, it's usually you just go up the seam and then if I have the middle of the field, I take it. And what the defensive coverage gave me, I saw there was no safety. It was just uh, me against the uh, one of the halves here. And I saw the empty uh, middle of the field open and I just took it and I was just praying that Ricky uh, saw that also. And then once I saw that ball in there, uh, I went to go grab it. We went two, we were two and out. I wanted to kick the field goal, but uh, Milanovic, <laughs> he looked at me and uh, we made eye contact. I thought we, he was gonna uh, let me kick the field goal. I wanted to kick it. it was, I think it was like 25 yards, 30 yards or something. But uh, he had no faith. <laughs> he had no faith in my legs, so uh, we, went, we went for it on third down. Here goes Ray, looking to the end zone. The pass is caught! I had a switch release with JB right here. And uh, it was just a basic corner out with the switch release. It sets me up with the DB, have, uh, having him in my inside hip, and then it's just a basic corner out from there. And I just figured that uh, Rick, being Ricky, he would see it and throw it, and I just ran as fast as I could, and once I saw it in the air, I actually, I actually lost the ball in the, in the lights, yeah. Um, there's like a little split second where I kind of look surprised. I was looking on the TSN cut, uh, TV cut up that, uh, I kind of hesitated because I couldn't see the ball and then I just uh, readjusted once I saw it. Every uh, play that we have, everybody sets everybody up. Like if it's JB here, if JB didn't run his route the way he ran it, that guy wouldn't have uh, bit on JB and it would have gave me uh, all that field in the back. And with Andre in the, to the field, with him running the wide depart hitch here, that corner, he's locked on man. And if Dre didn't run it like that, he could have sloughed off and he could have made a play on that corner route, scored the touchdown, all the hoorah-rah, and then I look back and I'm like, oh yeah, Swayze's not, <laughs> not going to kick the ball, that's me. I have to kick the free point. Yes, where all of this originated from. There's the spot and there's the kick. Once I saw Swayze go down, I just looked at Osh and I was like, you want me to go in? Thumbs up, like a thumbs up, thumbs down. He's like, yeah, you got a kick. But thank God that uh, O'Shea, we actually were practicing a little bit the uh, past couple weeks, um, trying to get my footing down and uh, trying to hit the ball. In my whole football career, I never thought I'd, I, I thought I could kick, but I never actually figured I'd be doing it on a pro level. After he scored, which I think is a rule change you should adopt. You should have to do this. It, it, like going back to the real rugby yeah. world, where all of this originated from. There's the spot, and there's the kick. Hey, they had no line, but it was just step, kick. Little punch nine iron. That's nice, Davey. That's nice.